Hi, it's Kelly Waterloo, personal trainer and group fitness instructor, coming your way with another new workout. So, this involves TRX and dumbbells. We're also gonna use a mat. So let's get going, we're gonna warm it up. So, first of all, I want you to take out four, 10 squats. Drop and lift, good. Side view, make sure your knees are never over the toes. Just an easy does it warm up. Lunge back, drop and lift. Looks good. Chest is out, shoulders are back. Two more, two more. Step in, switch legs, let's go. Drop and lift. You got it, up. That's good, back heels lifted please. Beautiful job. Now reverse fly. One, two, three. Bring it down. No weights. One, two, three. You got it. Woo hoo! That's three pulses. One more. Awesome, now grab your mat. We're gonna get the front of that body warmed up. Push up, let's start on the knees. Two more, neck is lining up with upper back. Good job. There's your warm up. So, if you're gonna have the shorter version of this workout, that's your warm up. If you need more, repeat that all over again for a longer warm up, okay? And then we're gonna get started on TRX first. TRX. We're gonna do what we call a W. Arms are gonna be up like this. Be up 30 seconds, and then we're gonna walk in and make it harder. Let's work. So I'm at my garage today. It's really windy today. I knew you wouldn't be able to hear me. No farm animals today. Looks good. Whew. Well, post arms and pose said W fly. Locking your abdominals, please. Step in a little further, make it harder. Woo! It's good. Woo! Anybody on fire yet? Woo! How about one more? Beautiful, let's recover. So we call this a pistol squat or a single leg squat. You take your foot out, you come down. If you want it meter, you get lower. If you need to modify it, you'll tap your toe. We're gonna do one leg for 30 seconds and the other leg for 30 seconds. Woo! Getting ready. Let's go. You remember that modification is just drop that leg that's sticking out, drop it to the floor. Woo! Feeling this. How's it going? Woo! Fired up, you guys. You got this. Switch feet. Woo! Now, we got a little balance work here, yes? Looks good. Come on, come on, come on. Woo! Somebody's on fire. I think it's you. Nice job. Come on. Woo! 
Next up is our power pull. So I have discovered it's easier to drop a handle. Grab this one. Just hang on with one hand. It's called a power pull. So we're going to be coming here and reaching back and forth. Then we're going to switch handles and go to the other lead for the other 30 seconds. Whew, let's get ready. Work. Reach. Good. Feeling those obliques? That's our circuit. So, catch my breath here. I don't know about you. We're going to rest one to two minutes. No more than that. And then we're going to move on to our dumbbells and do the dumbbell section. Let's do this. Okay, I'm going to demonstrate. It's a bend over. Rear delt raise. Here's the side view. Now it's not a reverse fly. I'd go lighter if it was a reverse fly. So we're going to start out with that rear delt raise. Whew. Feet are hip distance apart. Tipping over. Four, three, two, work. So we're going to come part way up, not all the way, for 30 seconds. Showing you side view. Notice my neck is lining up with my upper back. And I'm not coming all the way up. I want to save some room to get harder. And I've chosen 10s today. You're going to pick the weight that works for you. Make it harder. Let's go. All the way up. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Back is flat. Open your chest. Bring that sweat on. Come on. Woo! Ah! Recover. Now I'm going to drop a weight, or you can put both weights here. 
Heavy weight at the chest or two weights to your shoulders. Are we there? We're gonna tap our foot. So it looks like this. It's a single leg squat with the foot on the ground. You could pick up your foot, but it's really, really hard to do that. By all means, go to that advanced version if you need it. Get ready. Four, three, two, let's go. So I'm gonna show you that side view. So it's not a lunge, it's not back here. It's right here. Woo! Nice job. So, are you breathing? Are you maybe singing? Whatever motivates you, come on. Take that belly button and draw it in. Embrace the core, please. Now my leg's talking. Switch sides. Here's this side now. Woo! Looking good, come on. Hoo-hoo-hoo! Nice. You got it. Ah. Whose heart rate's up? Anybody with me? Yes. Recover. I'm going to demo the next exercise while you have your recovery for 30 seconds. It's a reverse wood chop. Notice how my feet are pivoting as if I'm golfing. I'll do this lead, then I'll switch to the other lead. Hold on, you got this. We have 10 more seconds. Bring it to here. Three, two, one. Work. Notice how I pivot with both feet. Same muscle groups were worked on the TRX with the power pull. Good job, come on. Woo! Awesome. Now I'm gonna go to this side. Right away. Woo! 30, 30, 30. Woo! Come on. You got it, let's do this. Ah. How about one more? Rest. We're gonna be back into lower body again. I'm gonna put my weights right up by my shoulders. I'm gonna be lunging back and then tapping or lunging and lifting. Balance work there, yes? You got a little recovery time here, 30 seconds, you can do this. Whew. Sweating, anybody? Let's go. So here's your optional exercise, or you're lifting. Whew. Whew. Nice work. Just wanna show you that angle. Good job. Anybody struggling? Yes. Woo! Come on. One more. Switch legs. Remember, you can tap or you can lift. Woo! Nice job. Whoop. Trip a little there. How about you? Nice. Woo! Awesome job, come on. We got this, we are almost there. Recover. Now we need to take a break, get some water, get some hydration. Then we're going to move on to repeating these two circuits and then going to Tabata or shorter version of the workout is gonna be going into our Tabata after this rest. Okay, we're moving on to our Tabata today. Tabata's gonna to involve 
the TRX and your mat. So, we're gonna go down for some deep squats or power squats. It's not how high you jump, it's how low you land to make it a power squat. Then we'll bring it down to the mat for either a knee push up or a full push up. 10 more seconds. And we switch to Tabata timing, which is 20 seconds hardest work, 10 seconds total recovery. And let's go. You got it, come on. That was a tough to water. That was four minutes. If you're not ready for four minutes, do two minutes. Two sets of power squats, two sets of push ups. Repeat the whole circuit. Do it again. If you have even more energy, <laughs> go for round three with the circuits, but cut them in half. Cut them in half. Instead of a minute's worth of work, you do 30 seconds with a 15 second in between. I'll put that in the notes. So, if it's a lunge knee lift or a lunge knee hop, you do 15 seconds, 15 seconds. Anything where we're splitting up the body, 
15, 15 to total 30. Woo! Maybe you don't rest for 30 seconds. Like you only rest for 15 seconds before moving on to the next exercise. Great job. I'm going to bring you down to some cool down, some stretching. Great work today. Well, I hope you're dripping sweat like I am. It's going down my back, into my eyeballs. I love this workout. So, still bringing my heart rate down. Rest two, three minutes. And then go right into your stretching. So I'd like to show you some stretches on the TRX. So what I like to do is put my palms down, tip my toes up, and bring it down to a deep stretch. Arms are out. Hold. Oh, this stretch is amazing. Feel that lengthening. Oh, amazing. Okay, touch your toes to the floor. Bring them back down. We're going to cross over to a single leg chair pose. Open up your knee, get that hip flexor, balance. Oh, excellent. And you can hold it longer, maybe go 30 seconds on each side. Make sure you use our yoga or meditative breath. Sweat is dripping for me, but it's not just because it's hot today. It's cooler in my garage at the moment because it's still morning. It's going to be a hot one today. Excellent. Now, what I'm going to ask you to do is bring it to here. I'm going to take my right leg forward, my left leg back, and open up my chest. I'm going to rotate this direction and hold that stretch. Bring it back to the center, open the chest. We're going to trade legs. Open that chest again. Beautiful. Hold, hold. And then we're going to rotate. Perfect. Let's bring it back to the center. Beautiful job. There's a lot of stretching you can do on TRXs. I absolutely love using mine. So you can open up the chest again. Thumbs down and back. Bring your hands behind you. Interlace your fingers. Postural release. Hands up higher. Bring your hands in front. Protract shoulder blades. Round your back. And we're going to tip back and over. So step back and tip over. If you're able to, move the hand down. If you're able to, grab the ball of the foot. Toes to floor, tip over. Let's stand up. We're going to do quad stretch. Hang on to a wall if you need it. Maybe I need it today. <laughs> Reach up. Open. Let's go ahead and change legs. I want you to know we're never perfect. I'm not perfect. You're not perfect. And it's okay to not be perfect. Slide your hand down. Grab the ball of your foot. Toast the foot. I hope you're shaking and sweating with me. Let's stand up. Same hand, same foot. Give it a quad stretch. Same thing as the other side where I was more wobbly. Heel toward your glute. Beautiful. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, breathe out. Step out. Tip to your side. Oh, amazing. Let's reach and rotate this way. And get those obliques taken care of. Back to the center. Let's stretch to the other side. Reach. Fingers go down by the side of the knee. Let's bring it up. Rotate. Look to the side. And you have yourself a wonderful day.